Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia presents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast, establishment of an honorary consulate of Western Armenia in the city of Lyon of the French Republic and its region, the seventh session of the second convocation of the National Assembly of Western Armenia, report of the chairman of National Assembly Neri Harutsunyan as chairman of the Legal Commission, the Nangi community of Artsakh tends to develop the head of the community, a meeting of the State Council for Protection of the Cultural Heritage, of the occupied territories of Artsakh was held under the chairmanship of Artak Begladian. Armenians in Syria's autonomous administration start learning their own language. The impact of the war and the economic crisis in Western Armenia, Shernag. The U.S. Commission on International Religious Freedom touched upon the issue of preserving the Armenian heritage that come under the control of Azerbaijan. In connection with the establishment of our consulate of the Republic of Western Armenia in the city of Lyon and its region of France and the appointment of the honorary consul of the Republic of Western Armenia, President of the Republic, considering the growing number of applications for citizenship of the Republic of Armenia and Lyon and its region, taking into account Decree 16 of March 12, 2014, taking into account Article 77 of the Constitution, Article 1, establishment of an honorary consulate of the Republic of Western Armenia in a City of Lyon and its region, the Republic of France, Article 2, appointment of honorary consular Republic of Western Armenia to the city of Lyon and its region in the person of Mr. Razmik Khachatelian. Article 3, this appointment has expandable two year time. Article 4, the decision will be published in the official page of Republic of Western Armenia. Karin, June 10, 2022, Armena Kabramian, President of the Republic of Western Armenia. The seventh session of the second convocation of National Assembly was held in an atmosphere of discussions and proposals. After the reports were presented by the members of commissions, and a speaker Nelly Harutunyan made a report in which she presented in detail the function and general provisions of the legal commission. The law commission converted in a first meeting on November 5, 2020. The topic, the issue of Artsakh today, was discussed on the agenda, which includes the following important issues. Why and under what conditions to demand the independence of Artsakh? What are the borders and consequences? Read Nel Harutunya's report in full on our official website. The Nengi community of Martin Region or Republic of Artsakh has a tendency to develop. About this in an interview with the correspondent Artsakh Press, the head of the community, Zarmi Kamalan, said, according to him, in a village rich in fruit orchards, springs, forests, numerous monuments, hardworking residents continue to create. He said that the main occupation of the residents is cattle breeding. The head of the community, Kamalan, singled out round the clock water supply from the problems. The village is 60% provided with water. As a result of 44 day war, the rules of about 52 houses were damaged. With government funding of Artsakh, 22 has been repaired, another part has not yet been repaired. The village is not gasified, the need for which is felt, the head of the community said. The first meeting of the State Council for the Protection of Culture Heritage of the Occupied Territories of Republic of Artsakh was held on June 13th under the chairmanship of the State Minister of Republic of Artsakh, Artak Begladian. Especially after the war, the Council was formed in the need to coordinate the work on the protection of culture heritage of the Occupied Territories of Republic of Artsakh in order to unite the efforts of state bodies and expand the circles of two Armenian states. Among the function of the Council is monitoring and recording encroachments and crime against our culture heritage, preserving facts on various international platforms, Artak Begladian noted, taking into account the state policy of culture genocide on part of Azerbaijan in occupied territories as well as constituent activities to conceal distort facts and appropriate culture heritage. The Minister of State stressed that the Council will have a large-scale and coordinated work in order to use the potential of all state, expert the public circles for its goals. On Sunday, the Armenian Social Council had its first training course for teaching Armenian language at School of Speakers in the city of Hasaka, northeastern Syria. The Armenian Social Council was established in the city of Hasaka on April 24, 2020, to introduce the Armenian language, culture, and history to others. Teacher of Armenian language Lucien Ardemian told North Press that the goal of the training course is to prepare teachers because the Armenian language will be added to the circular of autonomous administration of north and eastern Syria next year. Annes was first formed in 2014 in the Kurdish majority regions of Afrin, Kobani, and Jazira in northern Syria following the withdrawal of the government forces. Later, it was expanded to Manbij, 
Tapka, Raqqa, Hasaka, and Deir ez Zor. During the past 10 years, the Council has started an experimental period to learn about the learner's ability to receive the language and to complete the number of members of the course. The experimental period was accompanied by an intellectual course about Armenian culture and history. According to Ardemian, the Syrian government has prohibited teaching other languages in its curricula since 2011. Therefore, it's not surprising that teachers may face difficulties in receiving the language at first, the teacher added. And Anyone can join the course. The sessions will be held in afternoons, she mentioned. Justice and development, the military policy pursued by the tandem of nationalist movement affects the people on signals of the economic crisis. Attacks by the Turkish government in Beytub Sheba, province of Sharnak, province of Western Armenia, located on a borderline with federal Kurdistan, began in 2015, turning the region into an arena of war again. The people are suffering from the war and the economic crisis caused by it. Every day early in the morning, people rushing to pastures cannot get a well-deserved income due to the dipping crisis. They paying attention to to the influence of military policy on animal husbandry note, we can no longer keep cattle or take care of our needs. Cattle branding used to have value, but now we don't see its benefits. These are widespread prices increases that also affect animal husbandry. Every day there are armed attacks that also affect us. After the trilateral statement of November 9, 2020 in Artsakh, concerns about the preservation of objects of Armenian religious and cultural heritage in a church which under the control of Azerbaijan still persist. This was stated in a report on Azerbaijan published by the U.S. Commission on International Religious Freedoms. This is reported by Lurer I. The U.S. Commission of International Religious Freedom has not escaped the fact that Baku creates many obstacles for pilgrims, preventing them from entering Armenian churches. In 2021, Azerbaijan the Azerbaijani government unexpectedly announced a change in a restrictive law on religious freedoms, effectively introducing new restorations for religious communities. The report published by the U.S. Commission of International Religious Freedom summarizes with a call to include Azerbaijan in a U.S. State Department special control list for serious violation of religious freedom in a community and for their tolerance by the state. Now musical part Armenian folk song. The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.